tonight. So amazing it can only be aired in prime time. The CSI team is back for another action-packed Rock'em Sock'em season of real-life crime busting. Bad guys are on the run and these CSIs are throwing the book at crime's ugly face. The evidence in each case is overwhelming. Really awesome. awesome. You've been sentenced to an epic hour of forensic science justice in Case Closed Real Crisis Investigators. <laughs> Real crime scene investigators, huh? I don't think so. Forensics case number 13, the crime scene investigator. Crime shows tend to place the CSI unit at the center of all the action. Often, they're shown in charge and pulling no punches, karate chopping and shotgunning their way to justice without much due process in between. But just how accurate are those portrayals of the CSI superheroes we see in prime time? Are they close to reality, or are they just another bunch of forensic phonies? One of the biggest mistakes television makes is merging the responsibilities of a crime scene investigator with those of a police officer or detective. It's important to keep in mind that people can and do work as both a CSI and law enforcement officer. But for today, we're going to stay on the forensic science side of the investigation and focus on the CSI responsibilities only. You won't see them carrying guns or even handcuffs. Unlike what's sometimes seen on TV, CSIs don't interrogate people who have been arrested. In fact, the only contact any forensic investigator might have with a suspect is to collect evidence after they are detained. Like, for example, using a buckle swab to collect DNA for analysis. A crime scene investigator's work is completely focused on the evidence, not police work. In fact, the majority of CSIs are plain old civilians just like you and me. So what's the CSI's role in a forensic investigation? Well, usually an investigation is broken into two parts. First, crime scene technicians search for and collect evidence at a scene. In coveralls, not designer suits, but we'll get to that later. Once the evidence is properly collected, it's dispatched to a forensic lab where it's analyzed by a specialist. Most of the time, these two processes are completely separated. So the role of a crime scene investigator is very different than what might be portrayed on primetime TV. One thing is certain though, CSIs are real superheroes who use real science to catch real bad guys. Their one-liner spouting, karate-chopping television counterparts are only experts in forensics. <laughs>